morning, YouTube. So I keep saying this every single time. It's another beautiful day. It still shocks me every single time. I'm heading over to, I might have chocolate on my face. I did have a Pop-Tart prior to my workout. Going to head over to the Equinox in Irvine here in Orange County. Apparently it's the biggest Equinox in, I guess, the biggest one there is. It's like over 100,000 square feet. There's like a rooftop gym and everything. So we got invited to try it out. Friday and Saturday, today's Thursday. Friday and Saturday are going to be the big days. We're doing a bunch of stuff. I am so stoked to show you guys all we have lined up. So I'm trying to keep on track here. There's so many, like the things about America, there's so many places to eat and just things that we don't have back in Canada. And it's just always beautiful. Just this fucking place. It, it's, it's crazy. I love it. So I'm going to just suck. <laughs> suck. I am just going to soak everything in and take it day by day. I might try and extend my flight actually. But we're going to crush this workout first at Equinox. Just valeted my parking oh, yeah. down there. My new whip. Boy Jess here hooked us up, checking out Equinox. Where is it? Well, this is uh, Irvine. Irvine, Equinox, Irvine. It's the biggest Equinox I guess there is. Look at this place, man. Beautiful. So we're gonna crush a workout, I guess, the rooftop here. Get a tan while we're doing it. Yeah. Let's get at it. What's up guys? So that workout was absolutely incredible. That place is wild. <sighs> Crazy. Rooftop workout. Sun in my eyes. I don't even care. I had a killer workout. I want to thank you to Jesse for inviting us there. Having a blast. So just another great thing to add. Now I'm heading to Huntington Beach. Gonna go check out some of the shops, some of the restaurants they have there. And I'm gonna go get a trim. Clean this up. Clean up this. Let's see how it looks after. I don't know. Let's see. So this will be gone for two years we'll still be making fun of them. Oh yeah. Yeah, we're still gonna make fun of them. Can't can't stop the music.
got my haircut at Eastside Barber here in Costa Mesa. I want to thank them for the hospitality and everything. It was really great. It's a good time and a really clean job. So I think I might actually keep this if I can learn to clean it up the way they did it. And then they did my hair a little different way. But yeah, I don't know. It's really clean. Do you think I should style it this way? Let me know. Let me know what you think. So now we're gonna go to uh, Huntington Beach. Johnny, who I'm gonna thank, I've said to check out this burger joint. He said they were real good. And uh, I'm always up for a burger. And hopefully hit a rooftop patio. Yeah, put my seatbelt on. It's my little cheat day, I guess. It's my little cheat meal, I don't know. So we ordered a burger, so I'll show you that when it comes out. I'm almost ready to set up, so yeah. four minutes and we'll get going. Pretty much like how long you've been collecting for, who you've collected from, and just about your tattoos. You know what I mean? It's super easy. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna interview you and just walk you through it, so. Cool. Yeah, it's easy shit. Sorry. I'll take yeah. it. So we're here at Selling TV in Los Alamitos. We are going to shoot a tattoo collector's interview, which is really cool. So I linked this up with Sullen and Uncle Jeremy on Instagram, and I'm really excited to do this interview. So we have this kind of setup here. They're gonna take me through basically my tattoos, why I have them, and who I got them from. And we're gonna do a little shoot, so it's pretty cool. So I'm excited to bring this guy to you. And I, like, I've been looking up to Sullen for a while now, and it's, it's really, really cool to be here now, which is, I don't know, it's, it's just, it's kind of like that. You made it deal. So like I, I like that, I'm excited. So I wanna see how this turns out. Can't wait to show you guys. We're gonna start out with your name, where you're from, and how long you've been getting tattooed for. So my name's Chris Fleming. I'm from Sudbury, Ontario, in Canada. And I've been getting tattooed for, say five years now. How old were you when you got your first tattoo, and what was it? When I got my first tattoo, I was 16, and I got calligraphy down my triceps, both triceps actually and uh, it was Vini Vidi Vici. I came, I saw, I conquered, and Molan Lave down this tricep. I actually got one of them covered. Every single girl ended up getting the same tattoo as me, so covered it. <laughs> it's bad, man. <laughs> <laughs> we just finished doing the tattoo collectors video or interview at the marketing company here for Sullen TV. Super exciting, so check out Sullen TV on YouTube. I'll link them in. I think it went really well. It was super fun. Had a lot of laughs and just a killer opportunity to talk about my ink. So we're gonna head over to Sullen, the actual Sullen studio. Go talk to Jeremy, one of the owners. Yeah, just cool, it's such a cool experience because I never thought I'd be here. I used to wear the clothing all the time, right? And I was like hunting down every Sullen shirt I could find. And now I'm doing videos for them. So it's really, it's a really, really like a, a heartfelt, cool feeling. So it's nice, I'm really excited. So now let's head over to Sullen. It's coming down now. I want nachos and I want burgers and in and out Jack in the Box. Hey guys. What's, What's up, up, man? How you doing? Welcome, welcome. How did it go? No, this is, well, it's, it's Jose's office, even though I've never seen him working here once, so it's pretty much all of our streets. Yeah, I mean, you got Street Fighter over there, you can have meetings over, you know, game of pool. <laughs> Do you guys want anything to drink? Water, anything to drink, soda. We got this going on right now. It's the largest tattoo exhibit in the history of tattoos. Um, they asked us to be a part of it. So normally this is a painting of uh, a drawing that Freddie Negretti did for us, but they borrowed it for the exhibit. Oh, that's so sick. That's big for me that you would even attempt to get it because like all day, every day, we get tattoos from all over the world like, and it's when so I'm flattering. Getting... So people drive by can see it. Yeah. Building. And with Courtney owning the massive, the die house, all that, we have a lot more office. I've grown these out to lunch. This is my business called the office. Yeah. But this right here will give you an idea of, um, of 
the direction that we're headed. So, oh, cool, cool, cool. for instance, they're working on spring 2019 right now. They work like a year, year and a half ahead. Minus this. This is. So when it comes in, they pull it off the wall. So now, okay, since, okay. We're, since spring 2018 is coming out, now we're working on spring 2019. So this is the stuff you'll see a year from now. This oh, is the stuff you'll see in a couple of weeks. Hey guys, so I really hope you enjoyed that kind of segment with Sullen. Absolutely incredible meeting Jeremy and like the, the hospitality they took care of me for Sullen TV and just letting me go to the headquarters, kind of see all that stuff. So that kind of warehouse they had housed liquid metal and octane on Sirius satellites. That was really cool to see because I listen to that all the time. So much more coming for you. I'm going to put a back to back video out. I have Gold's Gym Venice Beach, the mecca of bodybuilding coming to you. We filmed with Troy who owns Superhuman TV. That video is coming to you soon. I will link that in. So much more coming to you. I cannot wait to show you. Be sure to smash that like, hit subscribe, share with your friends. I'll see you next time.